Okay, hey guys, it's Ash. Um, so first off, I have to say that I have had like the cra- whoops. <laughs> The craziest week. I haven't posted anything in over a week, which um, from the first time that I actually started posting videos on YouTube, that's like absolutely crazy for me. Um, this last week has been insane. I had a daughter that was sick, and she was sick for four days, and then I had another daughter get sick. I had this red eye thing going on in my last tutorial, my last Valentine's Day tutorial. If you look really closely, and then that was a whole disaster. Some of the sound kept on going in and out, and I tried to upload it, and um, YouTube was just being silly. And anyway, so if in my last video, if you looked really closely like this eye, it was getting all freaky on me, okay? And so just with my kids being sick and everything else going on last week, and then I had a big Pamper Chef, um, like little mini conference last weekend. So it just took up Friday and Saturday. Anyways, needless to say, I didn't even finish my Valentine's segment. And I know I'm rambling, and this is supposed to be my Quick Tip Tuesday. <laughs> Anyways, it might be like the first minute might be me rambling on for just a little bit, telling everybody where the heck I've been. Anyways, back to Quick Tip Tuesday. Um, last week I challenged all of you guys to start your day off positive and I actually only did it, to be perfectly honest, two times last week. And I can honestly say the, fr the two days that I started out my day with something positive and then writing, um, I wrote something down in my journal um, about how I was gonna make the day better. My day did turn out so much better, 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 and I had like a total more positive outlook on life. Anyway, um, I want to read you a quote out of my Positive Words, Powerful Results book, okay? And um, the, the, it's from chapter five, and I like it because it's actually from a Chinese fortune cookie. The quote, sorry, my gum is like totally annoying. Okay, so it's from a Chinese fortune cookie and it says, respect the power of words, choose them with care. So that's gonna, um, that's what I'm starting out with for my Quick Tip Tuesday. Again, this is part of my four week process of making ourselves beautiful on the inside. And um, I have a bunch of just little cards and notes. A lot of these I got from like, and I have more than just this. And um, this is just a few, this is just an example. But like you can go to like Ross or TJ Maxx or someplace like that and you can get a bunch of cards for, you know, pretty inexpensive. I think I got these for like $2.50 and it usually comes um, like there's 25 in them. What I want to challenge you guys to do for this next week is let somebody know how much they mean to you in your life or something that somebody has done that may, has made a really, it has made an impact on you. So it can be anyone from a friend, a neighbor, a family member, your significant other, a child of yours, it can be anybody. Just take the time to write them a thank you note and really express um, how you feel about them or what they've been doing that has made you, you know, think about them or have, they've had a lasting impact. So that's my challenge for you guys is to really let somebody close to you know exactly how you're feeling about them. And not only is that going to make us feel good, but just think about if you were the one to receive this heartfelt letter. And make it heartfelt. Don't you know, don't just start writing words down. Make sure that your what you're writing really means something. So crazy week. I'm still gonna do my Valentine's Day tutorial. I don't care. Um, and it's gonna be in a couple of days just because my I have a lot of um, clients this week. Anyways, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you take something for um from this. Anybody who has messaged me or emailed me um, lately, just be patient with me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Like I said, this week has been crazy, but family first is my main priority. So I just want you guys to know that I'm still thinking about you and I hope you enjoyed this and I hope this isn't too long. Um, let me know what you're thinking and I'll get back to you guys. All right, um, make every day beautiful. Talk to you later, bye.